So this is a recipe for spicy, tu spicy tuna wraps using just a few ingredients and whatever you have around the house. Um, so we start with two cans of tuna, which I already have in the bowl here. Next we add two tablespoons of mayo, which you can kind of eyeball. It's about a tablespoon. From there, you're gonna add two tablespoons of the recipe calls for sriracha, but you should use whatever hot sauce you have on hand. It won't make anything significantly different. I happen to have Tabasco on hand. This will have a little bit different flavor, a little bit smokier, but there's no point in going to get a new one. So two tablespoons of that. Or if you like it spicier, add more. Um, then the recipe also calls for onion. What I happen to have on hand is I have onion, but I prefer scallion. So I have some scallions in this bowl. And because I do like spicy, I had some jalapeno on hand that I'm going to add to this as well. So we're going to dump that in. And then combine all the ingredients. And then you're just going to stir until the mixture appears creamy, um, depending on how much mayo you put in. You can also use Greek yogurt if you're looking for a healthier alternative um, that would be lower in fat and higher in protein. All right, so for what we made, this is what it looks all combined. I'm going to add a little more hot sauce. All right. Just stir that a little bit more. Okay. So then you're going to put this on a wrap. The recipe calls for medium tortilla wraps. I have small tortilla wraps because that's what I prefer. Um, so we're going to put some lettuce on here. It calls for a romaine lettuce and spinach. Um, that is what this combination is right here. We've got our greens. So we'll put those down. All right. And then the recipe calls for one small tomato. So I've got the tomato here. We're going to add that to the wraps. Then I also had some cucumber on hand that I'm going to put in um, because whatever vegetables you can add that you enjoy adds that much more nutrient value to your meal. And then you would just add your tuna mixture to the wraps. All right, and that's it. You have leftovers. You can make it for more than one person. You can make it for several lunches. Um, you can have it as a snack and it's quick and easy. Um, and most of these things you likely have on hand at your house, but all ingredients will be inexpensive. Um, I think they top off at $4 and then you can use them again to make more meals.